So I should have done some better thinking. What I want to do is I want to time how much water is pumping out. This is, every time I've come here, it has been pouring out at that level. And Dean has the old well hooked up to a solar pump. You see that? That's a big solar panel. And uh, it's running some electric pump in there. And what I want to know is if we're pumping this kind of water nonstop, running out, flowing, it's flowing even, Man, what if we were using it to irrigate that little field over here that's like a seven acre field with pecans? I mean, if we're just gonna waste the water, what if we were irrigating with it? It seems like we could do it somehow. Anyway, um, I need to go back and get some different boots so I can trudge through here and uh, I just wanna time it. Like that's the way they, the plumbers do it. All right, so here's some more information. So this panel, see the panel? It's got these four little things underneath it, sending, it looks like it's four separate panels put together on a, on a metal frame. And then there's this wire coming out of it, going to this pump right here. And man, that thing is just trucking right along. I don't know what kind of pump that is. But that is impressive. So it looks like it's four panels and the panels are at least, it looks like it's maybe three and a half inches by seven inches each one and there's and then overall let me just do this with my hands real quick it's about nine inches one two three four five six and then up here we got one two three so nine times three is 27. Six times nine is 54. So maybe 27 by 50 or something like that. And then what the deal is on these, oh, there's a name. Can you see it? It's a good panel, whatever that is. And they just sort of have it jury rigged. I'm impressed. All right, so this is pretty serious because I just clocked it and in 30 seconds, I filled the kitty litter pan in 30 seconds to whatever this level is. And that's not perfectly level and I can't, it's kind of hard to get it in there, but I tilted it and pushed it down and it poured in. And so I'm gonna put like a little mark with it with the um, with a Sharpie as level as I can get it. And then I'm also gonna get uh, these two liter bottles I have and fill them up and see uh, what that is. But in 30 seconds, that's gotta be at least two or three gallons. So in a minute, that could be six gallons a minute. And I was out here yesterday and the day before, it's been running at about this type of level nonstop the whole time. What if we're irrigating trees with this? That'd be amazing. Okay, so I put this bucket under here. I clocked it for 30 seconds. And for th a 30 second fill, it went up to about right here. And then I was able to fill six two liter bottles to the very top. So I don't know what that number is. Plus this one, this would be the seventh one if it was full all the way. So six and like, I don't know, seven eighths or something. I'm gonna now go home and measure to see what this is to the tip top and then we'll see what this is. And that's just for 30 seconds. So here's the water that came out of that well. It looks pretty clear.